Hello everybody, welcome to Geordie Goat, um, game number one of season two in the OCC. I'm in tier four or something, um, because I did had a crap record. This guy has actually got a far better record than me, 3-2-2. Um, he's got a couple of mighty blows on his blitzers, some block and some wrestle across the team. Three rerolls, so it looks like a pretty nice team. Pretty tough matchup, um, because I'm missing a tomb guard, a flesh, go flesh golem. I had tomb guardians last game. Missing a flesh golem. Um... Which means I can't get the 12th player because I need to save up for the replacement flesh golem because I'm going to sack him with armor 8. But 4 guard might give us a good chance and obviously mighty blow werewolf is good. Blodge werewolf is good. He's got no tackle so the, the dodge ghoul's alright as well. And hopefully, you know, just get some luck with the claw. That Wouldn't that be something else? So fingers crossed. <laughs> yeah, that's true, Crumsley. That's true, Crumsley. I shouldn't. I shouldn't. I shouldn't. Yeah, exactly. If it was just... Yeah, it would suck if you missed a spin, but if, if it was synced and everyone knew when the next... Because this fa whole five minutes is... Um, yeah, do they? Oh, well, there you go, and mishaps. Um, Self-tilting. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing. If, if they were set, if they were set at ten minutes past the hour, because this thing's so bad where somebody spins, and then it's five minutes from then, I think is a crap way of looking, because quite often people are going to wait five full minutes, aren't they? Which is not what we want, but if you knew the game was a, you know, the next spin was going to be at 1640 and there's eight minutes to kill, you could go and have a game of Hearthstone or whatever and then uh, and then spin in time or whatever. Um, yeah, Nifs, I did manage to stay with the lead. Uh, this, this, this is OCC, I got nowhere near finishing, the f winning the first championship um, in OCC, I just got banged on for the whole thing. I had... I had three deaths in the first game, and then a death in the last game as well, so it's absolutely awful. Yeah, exactly, mishaps. If you're going to wait five minutes for a game a decent amount of the time, why not wait ten minutes? Or, even better, have the scheduled... The scheduled spins is amazing. It works for Fumble with no players. But there's, like, nobody plays on Fumble, and it's rare that you get a really bad matchup. It's unbelievable. It's unbelievable. Unbelievable. All Skink League, yeah, that's pretty good. I think all Hobgoblins is going to be the way. Oh, yeah, and wait five minutes, yeah, yeah, exactly. They need to have, like, challenge things for leagues, don't they? Holy shit. Oh, man. At least when you lose this game, you can blame Dog. Yeah. Yeah, and, like, I'm... Yeah, it's just crazy. Yeah, it's true, Bizzle. Yeah, it's amazing, amazing, that, amazing that they don't let you do that, isn't it? Football too. Holy shit! Did they fix it? It was bugged where you only spun the last one mishaps. It, it was. It was. It, you could, you could spin multiple teams in Blood Bowl two, but it didn't actually work. <laughs> isn't that funny? Right, where's the blitz coming? Mm, I'd love to blitz them, but I guess I'm just going to block on the line. And use the guard to protect them. Obviously, I've got to go heavy just to like out strength and out bash them a little bit. Oh man, can blitz him with a fleshy. Or him. Mm, him, I think. Right, something like this. I don't really know what I'm doing here. Don't really care either. I've, this this is just another building season in, in OCC. <laughs> Distinct lab. Lack of wrestle, oh man. <laughs> right. Let's block him. Need a push. Good. Fuck. 
That means this guy's got to come in here, hasn't he, for this block? Hey, old. See you later, piece of shit. I have to blitz him. Guard in there could save him a little bit. Not really, though. Guard in here just gets banged down. Guard out there gets banged down. He just goes in there then. And then the guard comes up there. Okay, right. So this blitz has to be made here first. And then guard in there. And protect. Protect the precious uh, the precious doggies in the middle there. He might try to base the ball here, but obviously it doesn't really matter if he does. Yeah, it's amazing, isn't it, mishaps? Amazing. And the thing is, they're not even long wait times on Fumble. That's the thing. The thing about Fumble is because you know you're guaranteed... Okay, not guaranteed because there's so few players. But because you know you're almost certain to get a game at, say, let's say 16.45 at this moment in time for me. Eight minutes to go, right? Because I know that I can't get a game before the next eight minutes, but I'm guaranteed to get a game in that eight minutes time. It's not an eight minute wait time, is it? It's just like, you know, I could eat a nice sandwich there with some stuff on it. And I could just eat that there for eight minutes. And then I could spin. So, so I don't actually wait eight minutes for a game. Whereas on, Fum on Blood Bowl 2, with thousands of people playing, maybe, or at least hundreds of people playing, if you're the first unlucky guy to spin, you're waiting for five minutes for a game, and you just got to sit there in front of the fucking thing for five minutes, which is shit, isn't it? What's that? Is that the stuff? Oh, wait, I'll turn this up. Mm, nice. Oh shit! Oh shit! I didn't use stand firm. Run out of time. I was too busy. I was too busy eating crowd salad. <laughs> <laughs> it might do me a favour, actually. Oh fuck me! Okay, regen. This team, this team's getting banged on all over the shop, isn't it? I mean, I guess that's just like a kill that's come back, so it's not that bad right now. No, I think I would have, wouldn't have liked to have been pushed, to be honest. Because I, I would like to have pushed, pushed this one, wouldn't I? Because now this this push is awkward, so I would I would have liked to have stood firm. Yeah, mishaps. It wouldn't be a bad idea. I'm not down players though because he's down one too. I'm just down in value, so I can't complain. This game, but yeah, that was a bad not stand firm. No, stand firm matters because he pushed him out. If if he if he hadn't pushed him back, he could have blocked him, and then pushed him and then got another one. Whereas now, this is into minus two, which fucking sucks, doesn't it? Unless I run around and blitz him, or run around and blitz him. I can run around and blitz him. Just means I'll get blitzed by a mighty blow guy. It's really bad. Because I can't move the other guard in. 
I guess I've got block, fuck it. I've got block, you don't. So I get the push and the fucking horrific follow up. Holy shit balls. Good thing is if I get a push, then and then a power I'm safe. Oh, no, I'll just do that instead. Okay, four rerolls. <laughs> this is rough. I'm, pr I'm just tilted off the face of the planet after thinking about Dode and stuff. Holy shit. Yeah, I've only got one. Miss next game. Well, dead. It's dead because I'm going to sack it because he got minus armor. <laughs> reroll it, you conservative cunt. <laughs> Thanks, man. Yeah, I'll reroll it, even if I had three. I'll reroll it. Oh, yeah, bitter. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I'm really, I'm really conservative when it comes to rerolls. I'm so used to playing, playing, um, what's it called, Nurgle with, and having to conserve my rerolls. That was a good, that was a good chain, wasn't it, to get a block on the other wolf? Clever girl. I mean, apart from the guard. But then if he chains him out, and then he can chain out a guard. You didn't warn me, Sam Davies. <laughs> you just observed that it was about to happen. Oh, wow, he got it on the ball. That was good. You didn't warn me about that. That was a nice play, wasn't he? He got a 2D on the ball. Clever girl. Clever girl. Wolf not about to get banged on, but about a chain of hit on the ball. Clever. I think he's just going to blitz this fucking zombie. Voodoo Mike Ruinception. Yeah, it is. I, I, don't, I don't get tilted or pissed off, really, by Blood Bowl games. It's the stuff outside of it. Yeah, it is only a one day without block. Thanks to, thanks to these guard. This guard-heavy necro team. Although I've got no strength, at least I've got some guard. Out strength massively to be fair. Four black orcs against nothing. Nah, he can't he can't fix it with a blitz. To be honest. He'd have to what he'd have to he'd have to one day this guy, then one day this guy, then run round and blitz. So it, it was really hard to do. He'd have had to He'd have had to what he'd have to one day pow him. And one day just to push would have been good there, I think. No, I'd probably oh, want the pal. And he could change him down. Jesus fucking Christ. It was pretty hard. Pretty hard to get rid of him. And he blitzed he blitzed a um he blitzed a thing which is alright. No, it was pretty hard for him. He could have one D the wolf, but I mean I don't care if he one D's the wolf, do I? That's it's all right. If your opponent's one ding things, nah, I don't think so. No, he couldn't. He couldn't have done that, Bizzle. He couldn't because there was the the, the zombie was there. He's pretty much. Nah, I don't think so. Well, maybe he could have done. Maybe he could have done. I don't know. It wasn't easy, though. It wasn't. It wasn't obvious to me what he could have done. Mm. 
to be honest. As this lad's going to two dice this lad. That's going to happen a little bit right now. As I just have no idea what to do. Kills a bit of time, doesn't it? Making 2Ds. Mindless 2Ds. Could dodge with this guy, couldn't I? To hit blitz the blitz him. At the moment he can't do anything. One D him into a minus two. One D him into a minus two. One D him. I think it's best to dodge with him. Move him there. Move him there for the follow-up one. Oh, he was already there for the follow-up one. Oh, God. God damn it. Got him. Claw mighty blow. KO. Unbelievable. Unfucking believable. I can even go over here to assist. Oh, GFI though. I guess he goes around here. That's good enough. <laughs> Crumsy. <laughs> Oh my god. Worked all right, out all right in the end though, didn't it? it got that KO. He engineers a lovely a lovely one dice on the ball. A lovely couple of chain pushes to get one D on the ball. It gets rewarded by me making a fucking three plus dodge out into KO in his guy. <laughs> that's that's pretty that's pretty blood ball like. TBH. Oh man, here we are, one dicer from the Mighty Blow guy. Dirty fucking dingo. That he is. Ooh. False rub. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, beaver on acid. Well, okay. Not necessarily beaver on acid. There's two ways to say no to Mighty Blow on Wolves. One is if it's your second double and you've already got Mighty Blow and you take piling on, as um, as people say. But also if you roll the double six. Because the thing that isn't great about Wolves is them being strength three. So getting strength four is is just unbelievable. Even even you know it's worth giving up the mighty blow to get that. Oh man, this one dice, so. dirty dingo. Having four guard is pretty pretty spectacular to be honest. I'm tempted to go guard first on the flesh golems now, just because you know just to stack the guard boosts. And it's nice that he hasn't got any tackle here, isn't it? So the, even though he's getting to two dice these wolves a bit, um, it's it's not the worst thing ever. <laughs> All right, that's okay then. Dynamotes. <laughs> I wasn't looking forward to fighting lizards ever, but if they like base and screen with skinks, that's good. <laughs> I would, I would, I would, like, yeah, exactly some days, but I mean, Strength 4 Wolf is like the best player to have plus strength in the game. He's also the best player to have a double for Mighty Blow in the game. But, um, it's just too good. It's just literally too good. Because Frenzy is not good 
with agility, with strength three, isn't it? That's the thing. That's the key thing. That's the thing. Strength three claw frenzy is a bit shit. Just the fact he's got claw means you're like, you know, if you're playing chaos, you want him to hit the chaos warriors, don't you? And, you know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right, how do I even make two dice here? I guess I don't. I just get a 2D into a 1D. Looks good to me. Might as well stand him up first. Crikey. Can't blitz from that angle now. Because of him. Can't minus 2D. So what's this, a 1 dice into a 2 dice? Why not? He, he liked 1 dicing me, didn't he? So... Could have moved the ball first, I guess. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, it's game. That's game then, isn't it? Oh, shit, I mean, you got block. I mean, got block. Mighty ball. OCC team, not my best team. Yeah, that's true, Crumsley. I hate that Ulf Werners are so tiny. Holy shit. Yeah, I should have really moved him first, shouldn't I? If, I, if, I, if I'd realised this was the guy without block, I would have moved him first. Because I thought, well, it's only 1 in 36 to fail. That's why I didn't do it. Holy fucking shitballs. Holy shitballs. Yeah, I thought he had block. The Viper. I thought he had block. And then out of nowhere, um, he didn't have block. And he was on his ass. And the game's lost because it's 2D on the ball. And he'll pop it, and he'll pick it up, and he'll score, and he'll cast my wolf. Oh, God. Do you know what? I might just quit OCC. Zombie number seven. I might just quit OCC. Exactly, like, I just can't be bothered to battle through all of the rankings for years. For an actual year to get in the top flight. An actual year of real time. Like, it's so shit being in a league. Fuck me! This is what I hate about le Look, fucking hell. Fucking hell, man, right? Leagues. This is what the fucking... Like, you sure it's cool playing your games, right? But I'm like, I can play 9am... Till 1900, well, 900 till 1900 GMT any day. That's 10 hours availability of every single day, right? That's that's pretty good, isn't it? He's like 15:30 on sa on Sunday, and I'm like, how is how is that in any way acceptable? It's just bullshit, isn't it? So I'm like, yeah, I can play then, and I'll play then, and it's like, what the fuck, man? Why can't people like? Oh, it just does my nut in. Give me at least some choices. Not just one fucking time, 13 hours before we can fucking play. Holy shit. This does my head in. The guy the other day, fucking 10 o'clock at night for me. It's the one time he can play. One date. Here's one date, one, one specific date and one specific time slot for you. Cheers, buddy. Cheers. Just what I wanted. Just what I wanted was one specific date and time. Thanks. But yeah, leagues are leagues really are great. But fucking hell, they're a, they're a fucking pain in the ass as well. Right, so I'm dodging with a carrier. That's that's all I can do, isn't it? Dodge. With, I can't believe he didn't blitz the ball. But happy days. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Can get with probably some protection as well. To be honest, mm -hmm. thanks to all this guard.
Oh my god. The one dice killed him. The one dice absolutely fucking killed him. Glorious. Right, totally blitzing with the uh with a wolf then. Don't need to think about that for a second. Or even half a second. Don't need to think about standing anybody up. Just blitz with a wolf. See what happens. Now he can block him. He can block him. Oh, no he can't. Got him. He can block him, can't he? And then put the other guard there. Oh, shit. Alright, good. Other guard over here. And please let me get to that square that I want to go to. Good. And, right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so easy one dice. How easy the two dice? Three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI. So I have to make this extra GFI then. One, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI. Or a dodge. And no GFI. Yeah, okay. And then he can um, dodge and GFI twice. Oh, no, it may be better, better just to occupy him, I guess. Because otherwise he could swing back around, couldn't he? I think that's good enough. Yeah, that's true, Muppet Pac-Man. Yeah, I guess that's true, the Viper, yeah. That's... Yeah, exactly, exactly. You could just give the best time and display your own ability at the same time. Exactly, Mile. He could have posted, right, I'm available. These hours, these hours, these hours, these hours, these hours, these hours, these hours. This is my favourite time. When would you like to play? That's how it should work, isn't it? Yeah, fuck save moves first. When, when I get to hit somebody with a mighty blow wolf, I'm going to just fucking hit somebody with a mighty blow wolf. Obviously, this was the riskiest move because I was just... <laughs> In a way, I didn't have to do save moves first because I was always going to make this dodge and I couldn't use a team reroll because he had dodge. So I thought, fuck it, I'll just make the other things first and then if I reroll them, I'll reroll them. Yeah, exactly, Mile. People should give... Ooh, what's this? What's this board? Is that me? Looks pretty cool. It's nothing. Yeah, it just it does my head in it does my head in leagues and and that sort of thing. No, he's not respecting the surfs, is he? He's not respecting the the severe surfing tins that are about to happen to him. Well, provided I don't want in nine, eh? <laughs> provided I don't want in nine, he's got severe surfing tins on the way. Not oh, cool. Oh God! Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's really cool. Yeah. Holy shit! How should you play a necromantic into undead? Um, you mean like it versus undead? Um, well, it depends on the TVs and everything. What skills you individually have? Because you know, races are very, uh, very wide, very wide um, thing, isn't it? Races in Blood Bowl, because you know, a lot of the time it's the teams. One particular team could be a lot different from a different team. Um, I need this power here. I need this power in my life. Fuck off. I'd have to follow him then. And have to block him again. What a cunt! Right. Okay. There's obviously you've got to go for this surf here. There's no. There's no two ways about it.
unbelievable made a serve. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Kill them, we hope they don't kill you. I don't need to move forward this turn. He could GFI to there, he could block him down. It's getting really fucking dodgy though, isn't it? Holy shit. He could GFI to there, he could go there, he could 1D him. He could 2D him into a 1D. I think I have to not, not move this turn. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, so we can one D him, but he can't two D him, basically. And then this has to be a pal, and this has to be something good. Not a score. Right, that was the block one. Got to make this GFI now. And got to bang him down. <sighs> I can't believe I had four dice at this cunt and not got him yet. Got him. No, I should have pushed him there maybe so that he couldn't be cleared of from 1D there. Could have 1D'd him as well, I guess. This is fucking grim, isn't it? Really grim, this, this half. <laughs> should have served for the ball carrier. Yeah, maybe Colin should have. Maybe I should have done things. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Vlenic. It's crazy, isn't it? Making this up after a century's work. <laughs> um, no, I don't know about the second serve. I don't know about the second, so... Orcs are your best teams that make you shit. No, it's just, um... They're alright. They're alright. Man, one dice. KO. Unbelievable, Jeff. I knew I should have just hit him that way. If he hadn't followed, he could have banged this guy down, I guess. Now he's just going to get surfed as well, isn't he, if I'm, if I'm not unlucky. Fat fucking chance of that happening, though. Can't believe I smashed him with fucking four dice and couldn't get him. Oh, man, down a wolf. He's horrible. Yeah, the orcs are solid, yeah, orcs are solid. No oh, man. Get banged on. If he pushes me to here, he's just terrible, isn't he? Okay. He's not he's not literally terrible. This is fucking rough, isn't it? Just gotta, just gotta make a potato here. Certified potato. Um, he blocks him. And then he blocks. Oh shit! No, the same. He's gonna make a one dicer, hasn't he? He's gonna make this one dicer. Oh, he's gonna make a one dicer, and then the guard comes in. To blitz. Oh, he dodges.
and then two Ds into one D sir. All right, this has got <laughs> this has got the better payoff, hasn't it? So I'm just gonna go for a bit of greed here. Skull. Pow. Wow. Unbelievable, Jeff. Unfucking believable. Right. So now. Made the three plus. Outrageous. Made a push there. Also outrageous. This is a huge one. Oh my god. Get absolutely banged on. So now this is all pretty safe. You can chain him to there or something. Could blitz him and chain him to there, but then he could only move base. I guess he can surf this wolf. Um, it's not the easiest thing in the world, though. He could just dodge one, two, three, four, GFI, GFI. So, do I put him there so it's a one dice? Yeah, I think so. Lucky turn that one. It all in all, that was a that was a lucky fucking turn. To be honest, werewolves are amazing. Yeah, man, rays they are. Yeah, I think that I think that's too sneaky. Yeah. Yeah, wolf down. Wolf got KO'd, but he's the one without block. So. And two fleshies down. Yeah, fumble rank. <sighs> That's very Drew Crumsley. Fumble Stunty League is the only true test of skill, and I've won two majors in Fumble Stunty League, so absolutely, absolute fact. Oh yeah, he's it, you know, no, it's not easy though. It's not, it's not easy to surf this wolf. Okay, good, he's not doing it. Yeah, that wolf did also cause two kills before going himself. That's true, Crumsley. That's true, and this, this what, this other wolf. Has um has his dodge has been amazing, hasn't it? To be honest, let him go for that blitz and save him from getting knocked over. Yeah, you gotta play. You gotta play in box. There's no point playing in rank, to be honest. Full of just people like Sage, so there's no point playing it. Basically, <laughs> but yeah, I've, I've won two stunt mages. Isn't that good? Pretty good. He's not even going to base the ball here, is he? I'm not going to make any blocks. Well, maybe I should make 2D with block, shouldn't I? To, um, to hurt. To hurt orcs. Blitz with 2D with block and then I could surf. I, I think I've got to go for the surf. I think I just literally have to go for the surf. Because it's just good, isn't it? It's just good. Like sure it might it might I might one in 36 it. But it's just good to it's just good to get. It's good to knock over a shitty little armorate piece of crap like him. Um I don't even get to go for the surf doer because I can't I can't stop him. But still, claw hit. I'll go for the claw hit. Nix. Alright. Yeah, I wasn't gonna I wasn't gonna go for anything vaguely dodgy without a reroll crumbs though. I wasn't gonna make one in nine blocks at all. But I thought one in thirty six ones weren't weren't so bad. Dude is undefeated in the black box with his one game. <laughs> Striker Eternal Fumble Legend there for you. Oh man. Um, as what team are you talking about, Stunty? Um, obviously the ridiculously overpowered Forest Goblins. 
<laughs> forest goblins are just insanely, insanely overpowered. To the point of like, you know, being worse than Amazons in in real Blood Bowl. <laughs> that's that's true, Bizzle. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> Holy shit. You can't argue you can't argue with the stats, can you? He's, he's he's got the stats to back it up as well. We are not we are nothing to um to the Dodicles. Double five. I'd probably just go dodge, even though movement seven would be amazing. But def I definitely don't go guard. Um you could go guard, of course, but I really like I really like if I get a double for my hob. I go for dodge and make him a ball carrier. Maybe I should have said that in my guide. I should have said that. But um I really like I really like to get a blodge carrier. Yes, Niggle Blitzer, you should indeed follow BG Handras's BGH Andras. BGH Andras, I think that's what it is. I always call him BG Andras, but I think it's BGH Andras. Um, yeah, he's pretty good. Yeah, it gives you a ball carrier option. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, oh yeah, rookie then dodge. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and it's just it's it's good because obviously if your bulls get dodge as well, then then having dodge on your hobgoblins is good. The only bad thing is you can't really take um, you yeah. But even then, you can having guard on nine players is better than having it on eight, you know. But the fact he's armor seven means naturally you want to protect him, and then obviously making them, so making the ball carry is just a good idea, isn't it? Realistically, when you've got when you've got the armor seven guy, no, definitely not wanna. I would go guard first and two guardians. I'd go guard first because they're just like they are like a control team as people like to call Nurgle um, a control team Tomb Guardians you know strength 5 they, they really are kind of a control team and you could go Mighty Blow first but. oh great Out bashed again. Mighty blow would help you level up faster. That's true, and and you know, look, mighty blow can win can win your games as well. Um, but my guard gives you more three dice blocks, doesn't it? And it makes it harder to deal with them collectively. Whereas obviously Mighty Blow individually makes them bigger threats. Come on, this guy's got to come back for a chance, alright. So if he stays out, it's 10 versus 10. Alright, 10 versus 10, not outbashed. Nothing, Mile, nothing. You just lose, you just lose to um, agility teams. Just, just lose. That's your, that's your game plan against agility teams, is Kemri. Um, not the strongest game plan, obviously, but that's about the extent of it. Option A is to lose, and then failing that, you go for your plan B, which is also to lose. So, um, yeah, that, that's 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 the Kemri plan against agility teams. Just lose. Just say no to winning the game. No. Oh. <gasps> Hallelujah. But it's a touchback. You're kidding me. I got insane kickoff luck for the first time in my life. Not only that it I got a kick it wasn't a touchback, there wasn't a blue thing. Oh yes! Yes, thank you, Nuffle! Thank you, Nuffle! Yes! I thought it was a touchback then, I thought fucking hell, really? Really it's gone in for a touchback? But no it's not. Oh it's just brilliant. Wow. 
Wow, that was a good bit. That was a good that was a good kickoff, wasn't it? Holy shit balls. Throw a rock. It's a good mechanic, isn't it? Is his player just fucking dies and he almost loses the game? I don't know. Well, because he was dead and he had block and to lead. Yeah, it's just shit, isn't it? All these years, Nuffle was making you pay in advance for that, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> in a league I don't care about. <laughs> um, oh, throwing rock. Imagine imagine if it happened in Hearthstone, eh? Imagine if it happened in Hearthstone. Well, well, Kibbler, what do you think of this guy's deck? I think it's a great deck. I, re I you know, Reno, Reno Mage is a great deck. I, I, really think, um, I really think he's got a good chance of winning this tournament. What's this? The the first match has started and the the Reno's been taken out of his deck and he can't use it for the rest of the tournament. That seems a bit crap, doesn't it? Well, them's the breaks. Whimsical. Whimsical rules. Um Yep. Yeah. Throw a rock is just horrific. I might start taking it the anti-throw rock stadium on all my stadiums because even though the pitch invasion and riot cost you games throw a rock can cost you the whole league can't it ridiculous ridiculous oh he's going back to the ball them's the breaks oh shucks whimsical isn't it whimsical him getting him getting absolutely fucked on for no reason that's the nuffle, nuffle's whimsical nature Can't I? Actually, he protects him quite well because I can't. I can't. Um, I could just go like this, couldn't I? I guess. Right, I can. I can't. I can't. Oh wait. I can. Yeah. Yeah, but at least it's a block, though. Like as bad as that is, Jelly, at least it's a block. At least it's a fucking block. Like the throw a rock is just horrific, isn't it? More payoff for doing this, but I really want to blitz with block because I can. Just so I can say, ha ha, I've got block, you don't. I've done it now. Abandoned. Let's do this so there's a bit of a line. Defending. If only he wasn't stunned, he could have done some work on it, not getting knocked over potentially. Death. A death. Ticky tacker, fuck you, Barcelona. Ha 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 ha. Oh yeah. Got him. And the injury was a nine, so yeah, the mighty blow play was the correct play there. <laughs> Rolling like Lupak, <laughs> love it. Maybe I should have just protected him because now he's going to get blitzed. Oh god, fuck! I should have just gone back to here, shouldn't I? Oh shit! Rock really does take the piss. The fact it just ruins a whole league or whatever. Hello, Shonic. This this is looking um, it's looking good. This game now, thanks to the shitty throw a rock rule. Yeah, outbash to get. I was Carl Ancelotti for a time, for a time, but now it's um, now it's. <laughs> yeah, I need to change my pants. Yeah. Yeah, the Black Oak dies because the coach up all the throw. That's true. Thanks to the shitty. Thanks to the shitty fucking throw a rock rule. But yeah, this was bad exposing him. No block to protect him. Gets hit by the both down. Into KO. See, if I'd just run him back, there was no need to put him forward. He's movement eight. I should just gone back here. I should have knocked him over and gone back here. That was bad play. Rightly punished by the KO. I've got, I've got no... No, uh... No, no, nothing. No feel bad there. That was, that was fine. That was my mistake. I should have run him back. Yeah, the other one. The F in advance was, was fair. It was bad play by me. Yeah, exactly, Charlie. Yeah. 
Yeah, I was absolutely. Oh, it happened. Yeah. yeah, it's standard, but it was my fault. I, I I didn't need to take the trade. I could have just moved back here. I was like here or something. I could have just moved back here, and then I guess it's this guy that gets KO. Well, no, he would have been bought down. I don't know. I'm not sure. I like that trade, Norm. Though I don't, I don't really like that because the wolf is worth 140k, and his black orc's worth 80k. So on this drive, I want to win the game. Not that good a trade, is it really? But he hasn't got a safe cage, has he? With him being based, can 2D him easily, and then at least a 1D on the ball. Ah oh, no, he stopped it. He stopped it. Well, could 1D him in for a 1D on the ball? Not the best thing in the world. Um, I could even uphill block him. For the push. Into the one, two, three, four, into the two D in the ball. Do I do I dare up go for the uphill block player? I definitely do. Banged on TM. Now the guard can come in here and he can make his dodge to try and get in as well. Right. Crazy motherfucker. <laughs> Yeah, exactly, Jalil, yeah. I should have... I shouldn't have done... I shouldn't have... I should have absolutely... I should have just kept my wolves safe. But... We wolves are majestic. <laughs> That's very true. Shame that I had four dice at the ball and didn't get the knockdown, though, wasn't it? Bit unlucky. Yeah, it tends to, doesn't it, Maya? It does, yeah. Astro Granite was the best when you didn't have the option of the of the um, of the grid. Um, I would say I would say undead definitely. I stay puffed because, well, as you can see from my guys, you, my guy, you can go on the old inter inter tubes, and um, if only Scroll Dude, yeah, VIP Scroll Dude, <laughs> if only he did. Um, yeah, basically that's it. There's more strength and claw is well, claw's good, but um, the strength. See, I knew, I thought this might have fucked me taking him away because it did leave him free to to do this. But on the other hand, I don't think he'd fucking pa one dice power and break armor. Um, yeah, mummies are straightforward, and like werewolves are amazing, but. You know, Frenzy is a bit of a double-edged sword, isn't it? He's still, there's still a guard guy there, so he's still not in great shape, is he? Whole, whole team banged down here. Fun times. Fun times. Yeah, you start with nothing. That's the thing, Nickel Blitzer. Yeah, with, with Necro, you do start out pretty bad. Oh, God. You do start out pretty bad as... Um, as Necro. As if you got that. As if you got that stun as well. Holy shit! 
Holy shit. Instead of the wolf just banging him. Banging him with 2D. Like, does he dodge? Or does he just not care that he's going to get blitzed next turn? I don't know. I don't know what he does. It's a 1D power storm, isn't it? <laughs> it's true, Mile. It's true. Oh, man. He's just going to get blitzed, isn't he? Absolute madness. And I mean, if it's a pow, then I get a blitz him into another 2D as well. The wolf's stun, though, huge, isn't it? If it wasn't for that, I would have got him. I would have got him for sure if he hadn't, if he hadn't stunned the wolf. Yeah, I think he should have dodged, definitely. Definitely should have dodged. In my humble opinion. <laughs> Unless he just 1D powers here. I <laughs> get the stun! <laughs> oh. Safe moves first. Are you watching, Fash? Gets a, gets two stuns that turn he got. Outrageous. Right, but I'm, I'm going to do this first so I can see where the ball ends up before I stand him up. Like I'm going to knock him down. Wow, did. <laughs> That's where the ball ended. Oh, I've only pushed him to there. <gasps> Fuck. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Do I do it? <sighs> I've only pushed him to there. Right. It's too easy for him to two dice me. I've got to do it, haven't I? Because once I'm turning up, I've won. <sighs> Holy shit. Gortino. Alright. No wolf pack. He's been killed the whole game, hasn't he? That, that orc. That orc's been a good, a good little Kazman. TBH. Level up for the ghoul there. Eh? Good old Tino. And yeah, that gives me another player, doesn't it? The death. So he's only got nine now. Three, six, nine, yeah. Nine versus ten. Not bad. Could maybe make it three here. <laughs> God, having loads of guard is amazing. Like. No tripwire. Unbelievable. Miracles happen, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it was 2 plus to win the game. That's at the end of the day, wasn't it, kind of like, Yeah, and he had re-rolls. So it was, it, was, it was easy. All he had to do was make, like, a GFI to mark and, like, a GFI to blitz or whatever. Throw a rock absolutely fucking in there, didn't it? Absolutely fucking throw a rock. Just stupid. And, you know, and someone says, ah, but you know, won't complain about throw a rock when it doesn't happen. And it's still, it's still crap, isn't it? Even though I'm benefited from it, it's still a crap rule. Obviously, yep. Thank you, Will King. <laughs> Thank you, Will King. Yeah, I don't, I don't care about it, but um, I still like to win. I still, <laughs> but then having said that, one game in the OCC, I just randomly lost for fun, which is was a weird thing to do. Oh man! All right. <laughs> I was up players for a turn. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I would really like that's not a bad idea that to have a counter of the turns that I'm up men and the turns number that I'm down men would be interesting 
do not use them. So. Mm -hmm. Yo. Mm -hmm. The thing is though, Jelly -o, it ain't gonna get fixed. <laughs> yeah, it's good, isn't it, VIP Kurgo? And then down again. It lasted for one fucking turn. <laughs> and I had to use a kickoff event to get there as well. <laughs> kickoff and claw mighty blow is what it took to get up, man. Um, it's never going to happen, Jelly Hill, because, because the inducement rules are worse in Blood Bowl 2016, which is now, like it or not, the only official rule set, isn't it? So we've got to forget CRP, because CRP is just as dead as Living Rubric fucking 3, you know? Living Rubric 4, like it was on Fumble, it's just dead. It, there's no more CRP, there's no point no point thinking about how Petty Cash used to work, because it's, it's just gone. And so we've got, to, we've got to accept that as bad as this inducement system and Petty Cash is, it's better than the, the only other alternative. The only alternative, not the only other alternative. Um, crazy, eh? Right, I could blitz him. And then just go on a rampage with this fucking guy. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Tag him. I don't want to tag him with anybody. Run him round. Why not? The new rules around inducements are it's like cyanide, but there's no bank. So money never, ever, ever counts to what you can spend. I don't think it needed that many evers, but um, yeah. One in nine in a death? No. This is truly my game. Holy shit. Exactly, Mile. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, there's just no bank rule. Man, look at that. Smooth powers me on the first one. Fucking hell into a KO. Could you believe it? Yeah. They just literally did away with the bank rule. But kept the dumb as fuck inducement system. It's just unbelievable. With kickoff, it is good. That's the thing. The kickoff, like, how many times do you watch a game or you play a game and you're like, oh, if I get a riot or if he gets a riot, there's a chance. And I mean, it was the riot that, um, you know, that got me a win in, in, in UKBBL. And it is good that. It is good that you get the chance of like a riot in some games and stuff, and it does give people a bit of a chance. It's not, it's not terrible. Like the riot, even though it sucks that you you can completely outplay somebody and then get fucked by a riot. Um, it is good that element of excitement, isn't it? And like a blitz can always give somebody a, a way back into it. But um, I don't know. There's no bank rule in the go plateau. So they have the same inducement system as, as cyanide in that you're free to transfer as much money into into inducements as you want, but there's no bank rule. So you can have a million in the bank, it doesn't count, add to your TV. And the, the thing is though, you can't build this with a season rule. Basically you can't have that much in your bank. So so it's balanced a little bit because they have this season rule. Um, but basically, like in theory, you could have a million in the bank and then um and then just spend it on the inducements and your opponent gets nothing so you basically have to have a season induce a season thing in 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 ranked play like in not in ranked in in like matchmaking you would have to have some kind of seasons because otherwise you can like that's it in the actual game of of CRP, not CRP, Blood Bowl 16, you don't get those unlimited banks because it's just not possible. I could base him there, blitz him there, but do I even care about letting him score? No, I just care about my players. So the best way to save my players is by making a 4 plus dodge. Mm.
Yeah, exactly. Zwalzy. And it is good. It, it, yeah, rock is the worst, yeah, because it doesn't add anything. And at least blitz, you've got to play around. You know, you can set up to stop blitz, well, limit blitz and all this kind of thing. And perfect defense, they're things you've got to think about when you're setting up. But pitch invasion is just fucking dumb. But then again, pitch invasion has like, made some good comebacks possible, but then it's also just really pissed off people. Especially newer players who just get nine of their players knocked off by pitch invasion. <laughs> so, so it is a bit shit, isn't it? So it's hard nowhere to strike the uh, strike the balance. The thing is, if Golems were strength five, Toad Hermit, because I mean they are pretty, they look pretty big here. But if Golems were strength five, it would completely invalidate. Um, it would completely invalidate undead, which would be crazy. The next step of TV Plus would just be like, I am multiple griffs. <laughs> oh my god, the, the the three griffs. There were there were three brothers in 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 Blood Bowl, but they were um they were they were dwarf brothers that were uh, played for played for a dwarf team. Oh no, he's guard. No. All right, just missed next game. Um, oh, I can't remember them. I can't remember the team they played for. Yeah, true Brownmeister are in this are in the end are in the wide zones or something. Yeah, it's it is just crap. Oh god, he's fouling for no reason. What a bastard. Good. Good. Hopefully he doesn't foul anymore. Soft concede. Loopback style. <laughs> um I'd love to be able to do Haunted Fenograph, but I don't play an open and he does. <laughs> so, um, I mean, I didn't do it on purpose the first time I played him. I had no idea he was spinning. I didn't, and then I was like, wait a minute. I didn't do it on purpose. Um, oh, what the, oh shit, um, my guy was blitzable. Oh fuck, I should have moved, I should have ran him away, shouldn't I? Fuck, I thought everyone was on the ground. I was like, past the, past the turn, because everyone's on the ground, but he wasn't. Oh man, just fouling the wolf. Brilliant. Brilliant. <laughs> that makes sense. Now I'll move him over to foul somebody else. It's fair enough. I mean, I've done the same. To be honest, I, I've just chosen to bang on people for no reason. Um, and I mean, he has lost. So at least if he'd beaten me by fouling, um, he would reduce my ability to win other games and stuff. But I guess I just gotta get banged on. <laughs> oh shit, I didn't dodge away again. That's twice I haven't dodged away with him. I'm so I'm sorry, VIPs Gartley. I'm sorry. Yeah, I had no idea, honestly. I had no idea he was spinning. I did I did purposefully spin in uh strip in. Um, or Crendor, or Crendor. I purposely spun it in Crendor, but not, not, not him. And it was amazing because I just had dwarves, which obviously absolutely shafted him. Yeah, Canal plays open. Yeah, I just forgot. I just forgot. Forgot Fagors. It's easy done. Anyone can, anyone can forget. But twice in a row was pretty bad. Oh man, look at this. Abs absolutely standard match for this team. I've got two guys injured, four guys knocked out. My opponent has a guy, a guy, two guys out. One was sent off. One was ki only killed because of the rock incident. And then the K this KO has been killed the whole team match. So it was like a Kaz, wasn't it? Um, I don't think I can one turn with this particular, this particular amount of players on the pitch. Um, So probably better to just let's try some blocks. Good God. Necro are pretty cool, yeah. No. <laughs> right, smash. Might get some star player points. Maybe. Stranger things have happened. Like being on the winning side of a rock for once. 
Aha, uh -huh, I've got block, you don't. <laughs> right, GFI, the punches armor 8 guy. Oh, I don't even need a GFI, I just need to go this way. Gotta hit the armor 8. God, I gotta really roll it. I gotta dance, I gotta hit this. Nope. I don't want a GFI because I could die from it. I'll foul this black orc first because why the hell not? Might get a zombie. Whoa. I did as well! <laughs> get banged on! <laughs> oh. Beautiful. Oh no, I don't get the extra zombie, do I? I only get one zombie. I just played too much Nurgle. Played too much Nurgle. Oh shit. <laughs> well, it serves him right for following my my werewolves. Yeah, I already had one. It's too much, too much Nurgle. Oh man. <laughs> mm, justice. If I get a one, I've still got enough for um for the flesh golem, so I still reroll that three. All right, six. Excellent. And he's zero, so I buy him for zero. If I wish that was like a recruit instead of buy. Um, that's a tough decision, <laughs> isn't it? Just the viper, but he shouldn't. He shouldn't have been fouling my guy, should he? Shouldn't have been fouling my men. You live by the sword, you die by the sword. That's what. I, and that guy really did die by the sword. Oh, oh no, it was a lineman. It wasn't a lineman that died. Um, but there you go. MVP on him is all right, isn't he? He's an MVP away from a. From a second level or two touchdowns potentially. Out blocked, obviously, not surprisingly. Got out bashed. No problem. <laughs> two black orc deaths. Yeah, it's brutal, isn't it? <laughs> it's absolutely, absolutely banged on, to be honest. In miss next game is okay. Oh, ha. Oh, yeah, and that, got, that kill got him the level, didn't it? Oh, God. I was I was so excited to get panning on. I'm not going to take the skill yet. He will get blocked, but I'm not going to take it yet. I'm going to take it last second before the next match. Like to keep my opponents on their toes. Could be a surprise piling on that you'd have to play, and I guess he's gonna go block. Um I'll just replace this flesh golem probably. So that was a nice little match, wasn't it? And who's the second round against? Um Under Mountain Wanderers. Dwarves. Oh fuck off dwarves. Fuck dwarves, seriously. Three guard, four mighty blow. Oh man. <sighs> the good thing is he's only got 11 players. So if the claw does work, I've got half a chance against him. 3 2 2 again. So I probably got the worst record by far in this group because the first season I did shit. <laughs> I did 2 1 4 first season. <laughs> Holy shit. Um. I am a monster to come over that file. Thank you, Wild Dog. Two thousand and three nine. Oh, holy shit! Um, that was brutal, wasn't it? Holy fucking shit! That foul, that turn sixteen foul. Sweet. Got to do it in the league, though, haven't you? When your opponent fouls you, you got to foul them back. Now he'll next match. He'll be less likely to foul my wolves if I ever play him in again. And yeah, he's not looking he's not looking good at all, is he, for his next opponent? Um but right. Thank you. Thank you for watching everyone. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.